All right, this is part two. My video cut off. So, uh, um, got that cream in there. The heavy cream. You see the mango, onions, and garlic in there. Cream starting to thicken up a little bit. Whip it a little bit. Yeah. In a few minutes, I'm gonna dump the um, dump those shrimp in there, and uh, then that cheese. And then uh, I gotta wait for those noodles to get done. You know what? Put the noodles on myself. Usually that. Usually my wife's job. Uh, it's fettuccine noodles, yo. Fettuccine. Fetta, fetta, fetta. So you could call this fettuccine, you could call this, um... Alfredo, whatever you want to call it, it's made the same way. It's just, from my knowledge, it's made the same way. And um, just different noodles. Different style noodles. So you call it what you want. Now I'm at the telephone. I can't even pause this joint. That's why. Um, I had to eat a strip though. Look at them bad boys. Delicious. Mm -mm -mm. That white wine. That's good, that's good. Word up. Word up, B, that's good, B. I like to let my heavy cream thicken up just a little bit. Get just a little thicker than what it is when it comes out the um, container or whatever. Just let, let it get a little thick. And then you go in with the um the new I mean your uh, shrimp and uh and your uh, your cheese. So I'm let it thicken up just a little bit though. Get that, give everything a chance in there to, to come together. Feel me? Trash out. Yeah, clean up while you cook.
You gotta clean up while you cook. And uh, make sure you drink it. It's very important. One of the key ingredients. Don't get too good with it now. Don't put your glass at the top. You know what I mean? Quarter glass. Because I sip this in. I see right there. Alright, it's looking good. I wish I would have put a little less uh, mango, but it's all good. I didn't mean to put that much. Put all that seasoning out of the, out of the bowl, out of the plate. Let that simmer for a minute. Well, I just put the shrimp in there. Let that simmer for a minute, and then um, then I'm going in with the cheese. And I'm just going to sit on the back burner for a minute. Let these noodles get done. Dump the noodles in there. And then, you know, mix it together. And voila, it's magic. Yeah. It's coming together real nice. Taste my sauce. I actually think I don't need nothing right now, to be honest. I'm just being honest. A little extra garlic and um, garlic powder, a little onion powder. Just go real lightly. I mean, I don't really think I need nothing else, but gotta always compensate for the uh, for when the noodles get in there. I love this stuff right here. This black pepper. It's the best, man. I never have enough of that. It's a little bit of Mrs. Dan. It's a little bit. A little too heavy. A little bit is here. A few sprinkles. Boom. That's how you think. Put my seasons back real quick. Uh -huh. Cook it clean, cook it clean, clean the cup. Ah, uh, wrong place for that. And like this right here. Um. So that's that. That's that. Um. Mix this in, give it another taste. Turn my fire down on this real quick. Oh no, uh, want to simmer. Uh, drink some wine, let's see. That's good. Cheese there. Done with the 
garlic. That back. Alright. Stir this around, let it get up in there. Get all gooey ooey. right there. Yep. What you looking for, baby? good right there. I don't know your man fucking with me. Let's see here. It's a little butter or something. I think they started to stick. to the noodles already. Yeah, that smells good too. It's a little loose than I want it to be. I still gotta remember when them noodles get in there, they're gonna soak up a lot of the flavor. Soak up a lot of juice. I mean, it tastes decent to me. You know? Then uh, these noodles, all you gotta do is just Flip it around. Take those noodles, dump them in the pot, bring it all together, with the salmon and all that. Serve, nice little cup of wine, you know? That's it. That's it, that's all it takes. It's New York, baby. You feel me?